AM AM stock Ambrax by Pharma Inc is on the move in this pre-market session and has blasted to a gain of 158.6%. The news behind this rally, let's get it, is that uh, we have it here. It's saying that um, Ambrax, Pharma, um, Ambrax has announced encouraging preliminary safety and efficacy data evaluating ARX uh, 788 in, her, in HER to positive metastatic breast cancer patients who progress following TD. M1 treatment okay, data to be discussed in the spotlight post presentation at the 2022 San, San Antonio Breast, Breast Cancer Symposium. Preliminary phase two results from ACE Breast 03 study demonstrated 757.1% confirmed overall response rate by uh, RECIST version 1.1 and 100% disease control rate DCR in heavily pre-treated patients in HER2 positive metastatic breast cancer following treatment with um, Ambrax's um, ARX788 anti-HER2 antibody drug conjugate. Okay, that's uh, what's behind us rally. Okay, the gain is now 168.36%, now trading at $1.1, has come into the whole number, ratio, whole number prices. 8.714 million shares have crossed the tape. Is it optionable? It is optionable. Oh my goodness, yes. Uh, it's That's interesting. Penny stock rose from the ashes of $0.8 or there about $0.4. You know, has more than doubled now. Let's uh, see what else is going on there. Okay, we have um, upper projections. Let's get a daily chart that may have been surpassed as well of 1.24, 1.24, that's what we have currently. We had previous targets of, uh, all these other targets have been knocked out as just as we, you know, began to record this. Okay, Zero, all of these have been knocked out. 106 has been, 1.06 has been knocked out. Next one is 1.26, 1.78. Let's uh, 1.26, 1.78, what's the next one after that? 2.62. Okay, we have um, on um, on uh, trading view. This is the one minute chart. There is no; it's not projecting any anything upwards on the one minute live chart. It is actually projecting downward. It has it has it's actually projecting down uh, world projections. Zero point nine one seven nine. That's that's quite likely because you know you and I know that. Um, uh, stocks that rally like this in the regular in the pre-market session don't tend to continue that way in the post-market session. So downward projection 0 0.9179. I don't know if that's going to be of any comfort to you. Uh, then after that is 0 0.7875. But if you look at the one, the daily chart for the stock, you can see there are other projections, upper projections, just as we have. We have uh, 1.2475, but this is static. It's not um, reacting to what's going on right now. Even ours is not really that much uh, reactive, but I think we can do something about that and um, see what we can do. This is what we're back to the, let's, let me bring it back to the one minute live uh, chart for AM AM. Upper projection still stand no pro, no upper, no upper projection here so far on this one minute live chart. So let's return and see what we can do. This is a, this is a daily chart for okay still holding at one point one one. We're holding at one point one one. Okay, and let's see. Let's return to the one minute live chart and see what we can project. We can just project it blindly. If we do that, we can. We're not going to see anything. Okay, at least we'll get down projections. Bring it all the way down to where it opened, 0 0.40, I think, 0 0.40. All the way down to 0 0.41, I think, yes, that's approximately where it is. So upper projection, when it comes out, we'll see it. I think uh, we're, we've surpassed 1.13, that was where we picked it up from. And uh, just like uh, the one on um, trading view, I think we also have 0. We have 0 0.96, the next downward projection if that happens that's also somewhere around where it has it's a 10-day moving average there as well that's where they made the contact the price and the 10-day moving average just slightly made uh, crossed over around that sort of level 
let's see what um, the, the let's validate again what that downward downward projection is 0 0.92 okay here on trading view it's 0 0.926 we have it at 0 0.96 you know some a few sets are different so you can see momentum is uh, holding steady holding steady for how many minutes now for almost more than 45 minutes holding steady this this is it hasn't um, dropped it only dipped slightly and um, so that was around um, 8 I would say around um, between 8.25 and 8, and 8 between 8.20 and 8.25 a.m. this morning in Eastern US time since that time it picked up from there it hasn't dipped below that is uh, on this uh, 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 oscillator the 14 period slow stochastic oscillator it hasn't dipped below uh, 0 0.71 it hasn't the momentum is extremely strong you can see the gain is now 200 percent trading at one two two four all our targets on the state static chart have, have been have been uh have been not on the on the daily on the daily charts some of them have been knocked out but um the good thing about this live chart is that it progresses and gives us um for the projections uh, 1.13 has been attained has been knocked out it's cooling off now down to 122 1.22 momentum still very strong rsi very strong indicating that um on indicating and validating that uh, buyers are in firm control of the proceedings as it concerns am am stock right now as things stand in this pre-market session we're counting down to the open of the session we have uh, 40 rough, roughly 40 minutes before the market opens and there's every good chance this is going to retrace when the market opens there's every good chance that is the case so downward projections of 0 0.96 0 0.86 0 0.77 0 0.68 0 0.58 all of them are on the cards so let's return to the the daily chart and see what we have here these ones are yes when the market opens the, these may begin to probably uh, um, maybe project automatically but um, it's at uh, 1.16 okay our target of 1.26 wasn't met I don't think it actually met that 1.26 we're gonna find out later on yes down projections okay this is more slightly more in line with the that of the trading view 0 0.94 0 0.84 0 0.72 0 0.62 0 0.42 okay yeah it's, it has lost shaved off shaved off uh 20 percent of those gains right now as we speak trading at 1.16 volume is uh 11.324 million shares this is definitely there's a good chance it's going to attract a lot of market participants when the market opens but um there's a trap here there's a bull trap here you know i'm i'm, I'm foreseeing this you know it's, it's going to plunge it's going to plunge it's also optionable and uh it doesn't have um it really doesn't i don't think it has um it doesn't have uh, okay these are going to expire it doesn't have weekly uh contract it doesn't have weekly contracts so um but in any case it's expired it's um it's moving up we can't get the figures for these because the market haven't ha the market hasn't opened yet okay it's returning back up again has gained around uh, it has re recovered 12 uh, percent recovered 15 percent now at uh, 195 percent gain you can see it uh, bounced off around here at uh, 1.14 1.14 okay AM AM stock on the move 1.24 is one of the targets 1.78 is one of our targets but downward retracements we have 0 0.96 0 0.86 0 0.77 um, these are much more likely I mean just based on what we have been seeing you know of late you know expect the stock to cool off you can see RSI and momentum especially the momentum is cooling off the 14 period slow stochastic oscillator is cooling off now as uh, but still still above uh, 70 on this uh on the on, the, on this oscillator still above 70 indicating that um, stock is um, not 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 no longer overbought at the moment but still strongly bullish you know so see what you make of um, AM, 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 am stock and uh, thank you very much for watching this video